Okay, what is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Deja Corinne. If you're not new here, welcome back. I missed you. I know it's been a little bit since my last upload, but we're not going to really talk about the jump. We're just going to get into this one, okay? <laughs> so um, right here I'm finishing up a painting, or not really finishing, just adding to a painting that I started in my last video. I'm pretty sure it might have been the one before that. But we're just going to add to that really quickly. And then, you know, we always got to go grab some food. It's a part of the vlog. And then I have something I want to review for you guys. I worked with this company, Upcrate. I'm not sure if any of you have heard of them. But I am going to review one of their boxes later on. And if you watch to the end, there will be a code included. So you can get your very own Upcrate box. So... Without further ado, let's just jump into the video. We'll finish up this little painting montage and get into it. Look what I got. An upgrade box. Let's open it. We're gonna work with these supplies later. But I was so excited. I had to stop at a pullover. I was like, we're opening it now. I can't wait anymore. So let's see what we got. Okay, so the first thing I noticed, this is a this is a German brand, if you guys don't know. And this is what it came in all the way to me. Like it didn't come in a bag around this or another box. Like it was just this. And I mean, pretty durable because it came all the way from Germany. There are little dings, but that's okay. You know, shit happens. But let's open it. I don't know the best way to do this, so just give me a moment. But you're supposed to rip it like on the back, like right here. And then there's little, these cute little eyes right here, just like looking around. moment we've all been waiting for i can get this side open oh there's a sticker right here um but i was really interested in these supplies okay this is so cute on the inside oh my gosh okay So it comes with the supplies all wrapped up like this. And then, oh, 
this box is so cute. Their marketing team, whoever did this, I love this. Okay, so it came with some stickers. Um, I love stickers. Putting this on my sketchbook. I just got a new one, so we're putting this on my sketchbook. Okay, and then it came with some artwork. I'm pretty sure the artwork on the inside is is done with the supplies that it, like the box has. So this is what we're looking at. She's cute. And then we got some watercolor paper. So let's open up the markers. I wanna see what the markers are like. Oh, okay. So it looks like we did get a little bit of damage. Um, yeah. Oh. It appears that the cap has fell off one of these. Very pretty color though. I actually really like these. Okay. So I've got some watercolor brush markers. Um, I've never worked with watercolor brushes or like markers before, so I'm really excited to get in the sketchbook later and do some stuff with you guys. Yeah, oh, it's so cute. So, that was all we're gonna do for now, just cause we're in the car. I decided to put this little nose ring on that I made. It actually, it's giving, it's giving. We're going with it. sketching with colored pencils. One of the first things I noticed is that these pencils are really smooth, especially on this watercolor paper, and I really like the pigment for these also. Um, so right now I'm just going to work on the sketch. I really didn't have anything in mind when I started this, so this is what we ended up with. And I'm just going to go back and add a few more details with the black pencil, which I love. I love that black pencil, by the way. Um, I'm gonna have to get another one of those, honestly. And then, I've never worked with these watercolor brush markers before, and they kind of remind me of Copic or the Copic markers in a way. Um, obviously those are alcohol-based and not water-based, but they were sort of similar. I had to really, like, get over this learning curve when it came to blending these markers, but honestly, they really are pretty unique and I did enjoy working with them it definitely took me outside of my box a little bit and yeah I kind of had fun with it so I'm just gonna let you guys watch for a little bit and then I'll come back in a second <laughs> Honestly, it was around here where I felt like things started to go horribly wrong. Um, the colors, honestly, it's a beautiful color palette. Not really, there wasn't any amazing colors for skin per se. And I'm a portrait artist, so that kind of like threw me off a little bit. So she's a little bit more orange than I would like her to be. And um, again, blending was such a learning curve for me because I work with oil paint, so things blending based with like water was just a bit of a different thing for me. I really do like the way the green showed up on the brown marker. I don't know if you guys can see that as much, but that was a really fun 
touch and the only thing that I used here that was not included in the upgrade box was just a white gel pen. You can see just a few highlights on her face but other than that I think the sketch turned out kind of cute. Um, again very beginner <laughs> sort of drawing right here. Okay, so um, we are headed downtown to the farmer's market and I just want to look around, maybe grab some flowers, uh, but I also want to sketch with the watercolor brushes while I'm down there, so let's hope we can find somewhere good to park and just get on it. downtown I decided to sketch with the markers instead I felt like that would be kind of fun and I really started kind of getting the hang of it a little bit definitely still don't know what I'm doing but I kind of like the way these turned out better than the first little drawing that I did and I really love the way these colors blend it actually is so beautiful so it kind of makes me want to get into watercolor a bit more I definitely think I will want to order another up crate box just because it helps me get out of like my comfort zone as an artist for sure and I want to start exploring with more things than just oil paint or pencil slash pen on paper so I had a really good time just doing something different and up crate is kind of a great way to do that monthly if you want or maybe less often or maybe more often it kind of just depends on you so that was really great and I'm really happy I got to kind of work with them in this video. So thank you Upcrate for sending me that box and I will probably be seeing you pretty soon. Also, if you guys were interested in the supplies after watching this review, if you do use my code DEJA30, that's D-E-J-A-3-0, you can get 30% off your first Upcrate box and try something else, you know, new, something different and get outside your comfort zone as an artist as well, just like I did. So again, be sure if you guys do want to check them out to use my code so you can get 30% off. And yeah, that's pretty much it for the rest of this video. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching and I will see you guys next week.